Hello everyone, Markus here from Göttford Weschhoff Prüfmaschinen with the first Göttford Roundtable. Göttford Roundtable will be a video series where we will show our products and also discuss various different um, aspects of rheology in general. This first video will be about the MI40 Visco option that's available for new MI40 devices. It will allow you to measure viscosity according to ISO 11443 and um, give you a far more comprehensive characterization of the material. Let's look at the difference to a normal MFR test first. So here on the left side, we have a normal MVR testing where you pretty much have a set temperature, a piston on top and a load on top. And during the measurement, you're just measuring the speed of the piston that is pretty much characterizing the viscosity and gives you uh, the MVR result at the end. With the visco option, we will turn this measurement procedure around. We use the drive of the MI40 and a load cell, and we will drive the piston at set different shear rates or piston speeds that correspond to shear rates, and we measure the force needed to reach that piston speed. The advantage here is that we can run at defined piston speeds, that means defined shear rates. We can measure at far higher shear rates and we can also run different speeds in one barrel filling. And this gives you a far more comprehensive and um, complete characterization of the material behavior in your actual process. Let's look at a um, application example here with uh, polypropylene at 230 degrees. A uh, customer approached us, he had problems in his process. We first ran an MVR test here. We couldn't really see a difference. Both of the grades measured a value roughly of 30, so there was no separation there. And then we run it with the MI40 Visco option, and there we could reach the far higher shear rates that are actually relevant for the process. There we could separate between both grades quite nicely, as you can see on the, the screen here. And Let's uh, look at the key advantages here of the MI40 Visco compared to just a normal MFR tester. Overall, you still have a full unimpeded functionality as melt flow indexer. Um, the measurement is fast and easy and you can get results according to ISO 11443. You can reach far higher shear rates that are actually more relevant for the production processes. And overall, the machine still costs far less than normal capillary rheometers, and the test itself is far easier to perform. Okay, thank you everyone for watching our Goethal Roundtable today. Stay tuned for new videos uh, about all kinds of uh, rheological um, applications, and have a nice day.